everybody! Yeah! It's Vlogmas, join us as we vlog each day. Let's laugh, have fun as we chit chat away with so many vlogs that we'll upload. Subscribe, don't miss a Vlogmas video. Welcome to December, we're vlogging every day, you know it's true. It's Vlogmas, Mom and I are here to say we hope you'll watch us too. All together! It's a festive month with holidays, we're gonna eat some fancy food and celebrate with so many vlogs that we'll upload. Subscribe, don't miss a Vlogmas video. Alright you guys, we're out and about with our five-star Uber driver. His name's Jerry. He says he'll hire himself out to drive you anywhere. No, I'm just kidding. Say hi, Ed. Hello. <laughs> All right, you guys, guess where we are today. We are out and about. We're going to end up at the Grove in LA so we can go see the Christmas decorations. See if Santa's there. Although, although you probably have to go inside. Yeah, no, you have to like pay to see Santa. See Santa yeah. yeah, so we're not going to yeah. do that because we're not going to take pictures. But we'll show you around. We'll go to Farmer's Market, you guys. That's my favorite place to go yeah. at the Grove. You guys know there's Farmer's Market is attached to the Grove. It's been there forever, you guys. Literally, I went there when I was a little girl and I'm an oldie now. Mm -hmm. So, but I went with my mom and dad to Farmer's Market. I've loved it ever since, you guys, and we still love it. There's all these iconic food places in the in the market. Funny story, I know, I think I might have told you guys this before. When we, I was little, there was a magic shop at the Grove and we went inside and my dad bought something for me and the guy distracted my dad when he was gonna give my dad's change back and he didn't give my dad's change back and I remember my dad saying you, you didn't give me my change back and the guy said yes I did and he never did and we just left I never forgot that story you guys yeah which surprises me because my dad I thought like for sure would have stood there and said I'm not leaving till I get my change back right but, but he didn't well, it's going to be nice that day, I guess, or not have the scene or something. Yeah. First, we're on our way to Roma's Italian Market. It's a very popular Italian market in Pasadena, you guys. Been there forever. We didn't even know about it because, of course, Pasadena is not one of our, you know, stopping grounds. They are famous for their pink paper-wrapped sandwiches. And all it is is meat, cheese, olive oil drizzled on the bread. They sell out all the time. We're probably going to get there too late because we're not getting there till about 1 p.m. So they may not even have any left, but right. we're going to see. Hopefully they do, you guys. We're so excited. Yeah. We want to try it so bad. They also have really interesting and good-looking imported items, too, and a deli section with, like, meats and cheeses and stuff. So it should be pretty exciting. So, you guys, the story of this sandwich is that in uh, 1959, a salesman walked into this Italian deli early in the morning and he wanted a sandwich and the owner told him, and the owner's name is Rosario Mazzeo. Supposedly, the story goes that he's never missed a day of work in like 70 some years. He got uh, some bread and put olive oil and meat and cheese and he sold it for 59 cents way back then. And I think now it's about five to six bucks, somewhere around there, yeah. I'll let you guys know. The sandwich was so good, I guess, that the next day, five of the salesmen, like his co-workers, came back to get the sandwich. And since then, you guys, it became so popular to this day, the sandwich is still popular. Yeah. Isn't that the neatest story? Like, yeah. yeah. We are here. There's a little Italian restaurant next door. Pietros. Pietros. Yeah, and then here it is. It's called Roma. I think we said already. Ooh. Look at all these noodles. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Wow, how cool is that? Oh wow, look at these. I've never seen these before. Oh my god. That's so cool. Oh, I love this one. The Fusili. Oh wow. Special imported provolone. Mm. Oh my gosh, I go crazy with all these. Oh my gosh. Italian salami. Wow, look at these. I know. Authentic panettone. Oh, those are good too. Oh, that looks good. This is sesame. You see all these panettones? Yes. They're all wrapped in paper. 
That's Rosario, you guys. All the meats and cheeses. Yeah. Wow. Ooh, they got some bread. Bread sticks. You guys, we got here in time. So here is the famous, as they call it, the sandwich. Mm -hmm. And guess what, you guys? Just like they said, just like the all the articles and stories I read said that they are just in a box by the cash register, and they actually put more just in the time that we were shopping in there. So I'll show you what the inside of the sandwich looks like. I can't even tell you how good the sandwich smells. Oh, it really does. And it's so simple. All it is is the bread and the meat, and I'll open it up and show you. So the ingredients are provolone cheese, and the cold cuts are mortadella, mortadella, capicola, and salami, okay? Yeah. And then it's just drizzled with olive oil. Oh, and there's pistachios. That, that's uh, what's in the meat right there. So you guys, so simple. Jerry said it's delicious. We have not even tried it because we wanted to show you guys. So now we're gonna try it. Here is my half of the sandwich. Well, we eat, we each actually got a sandwich, we but did I ripped this one in half for me and Jacqueline. Okay, I'm gonna try it first. Jerry said it was good. And this bread, you guys, smells so good. Oh my gosh. You know when you smell bread and it's like fresh baked bread? Mm -hmm. We also did a little haul. We'll show you guys what we bought. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. Everything's so fresh. The meat's fresh. The cheese is fresh. The bread's so good. And we actually got some bread to take home. We did. Mm -hmm. Which I'll show you. Yeah. Oh my gosh. It's 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 delicious, you guys. This is so fun. I'm so happy that we uh, found this place. I think I read it about it in my Los Angeles magazine maybe just like a, not even a year ago, you guys. I'm, I'm positive. I think the article I saw online from LA Times might have been two years ago. Oh, I think the, so, a lot has been written up right, about it. Right, so a lot's it, right. been written about it. But, but I think the article I saw was, I was in my um, Los Angeles yeah. magazine. But this is so good, you guys. You mm, want to try it? Yeah, I'll try it now. Okay, my turn, you guys. Looks so good. And yes, we are sitting in the parking lot to eat this. <laughs> and also, I don't know why I'm buckled because <laughs> we're not even. It's a good habit. I know, it's though. a good habit. Wear yeah. your seatbelts, kids. Yeah. All right, here we go. <laughs> You know, it's just, it's just a really good sandwich. It is, yeah. yeah. Just like a, you simple, just tell. Right, a simple but right. good sandwich. Right. 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 And I think they're about five fifty or so. I think so. so yeah, very reasonable, you guys. For it's it's a good size too. And this is the kind of bread you guys that's just like you could take it home, toast it up, put some butter, mm. right. just rip it, dip it in olive oil. Make a sandwich oh. yourself. Really good. Yeah. Oh, okay. And we'll show you what we got after we eat. Yeah. So we'll enjoy our lunch, you guys, and we'll be right back. So first up, we got three rolls, and you know we'll just either make a sandwich with these, or like Mom said, put butter on them, you know, dip them in olive dip oil, them in the olive oil, oil maybe. Oil, oil. And so we got two plain rolls, and one has sesame seeds on it. And from the bag, you guys, this one smells so dang good. Oh my gosh! I don't know if it's gonna focus, but it's some beautiful. Birds. You can kind of see them in there. I know. So so good, and I think these. Plain rolls are like what the sandwich was I think on so. that we ate. I could smell it as you twirled it. By I the way, I know, it. look, I'm making, I'm wafting it too. Yes. And by the way, the sandwiches were so good. And that bread that was on those sandwiches, mm. so crusty and delicious. Yes. So. A lot of the reviews said that their pasta was really good and their pasta sauce. Yeah. So we got this egg pasta. <laughs> this is tagliatelle. Probably saying it wrong. We like Parpadel, which we were gonna get. Right. We've had Parpadel before, which is uh -huh. why I say we like it. Um, but this one's a little bit of a thinner noodle compared to the Parpadel, so that we got this one to try. It just looks good. Yeah, you know look, I mean? actually on the back, on the back there's the different ones. Parpadel's in the middle there on the, uh, I think it's on the right for you. I think so. The, the video's like flipped, so it's hard to tell. But And then there are the noodles close up. You could just tell they look good, you yes. know? Yes. They just I look think, different. I think they, yeah. Yeah. Right? Exactly. So I think they look really good. That was three fifty. I thought that was a pretty good price. Pretty good. Yeah, it comes with four little nests in there. It's pretty yeah. good. This is all imported from Italy, so very exciting. And that's what everyone was <laughs> saying, too, in their reviews. They're like, oh, it's all so good there, everything that you get, because yeah. it's imported from Italy. So this we got. It's a bag of trophy 
pasta. What a cute name for I know. a pasta trophy. T R O F I E. I've never and, seen uh, have seen that before. I don't I don't think I've seen this one. And it's like little tiny twisted logs, swords, <laughs> spears. <laughs> um, they look like little worms. They look so they good, you guys. Like fun yeah. to eat. You yeah, know what I mean? Eat. Yeah. That I'm sure they'll plump seven. up. A little. A little more. Yeah. Yeah. I think they'll poof. Mm -hmm. Right. So we did ask um, the cashier what this was. It was near the cash register. She said it's a tomato focaccia. Kind of like a roll, sort of, but it's like flat, looks, you know, like looks bread. delicious. Yeah. Um, yeah, I don't know if they make this there, though. I think it might come from like a bakery, like Maybe. some other place. Yeah, we didn't place. ask. Yeah, we didn't ask. But that looks really good. I'll hold that up close so you can see. Looks really tasty. I love how they just like shove those tomatoes in those holes and then it's cherry like, tomatoes. Oh, looks so good. I know. Then we got this tomato and basil sauce with whole cherry tomatoes. So here's the sauce. Sounds so good. And we love basil. And the last thing we got, because we love garbanzo beans. <laughs> I, no one else calls chickpeas garbanzo beans, I don't think, except for Americans, I'm pretty sure. I wonder, do most people say chickpeas? I think people say chickpeas. I always say garbanzo. Most of the time. Yeah. yeah. And it's cute because on the can it says sessi beans, which I guess is another name for garbanzo beans. Chickpeas. Or chickpeas, I know. I think it's supposed to be Italian chickpeas they're probably imported from italy but they're distributed in new jersey that's right <laughs> literally we could just eat them from the can and we really we could love garbanzo beans we really could we love putting yeah. them in soup we love putting them um in hummus yes <laughs> hummus, hummus made uh -huh. or just making hummus i should say yes. yes we actually have a recipe of how to make really easy hummus without tahini on our youtube yes. channel yes yeah so i'll link it down below yeah. So you guys, we actually, we're, we're on our way to the Grove today, but we thought, you know, we would stop here. So then we thought, well, let's just make this its own video because yeah. Roma's Italian market deserves its own video, especially because of their famous sandwiches that we yes. finally oh got gosh. to try. And we would definitely go back and get, yes. get it again. What a fun little, and you guys, and what a fun drive. Just just come on down to Pasadena. I love Pasadena. It's, it's an adorable city. I really do like it here. Beautiful homes. You guys can yes. even just drive around the neighborhoods and look at the homes. <laughs> yeah. I'm serious. This is where the Rose Parade is, you guys. Every year that we actually went. Did you vlog that day, that time? We, we sure went? did. <gasps> we vlogged, I think, when we went to the Rose Parade one year. And it was really, really early in the morning. I think we left the house probably like at four o'clock. I don't remember if we vlogged. I think we did. If we okay. did. I'll link it down below and somewhere on the screen, but I'm pretty sure it's a video. So anyway, you guys, hope you had fun coming with yeah, us today. Yeah, hope you guys had a good time. Jerry's still us. here. Yep. Still so here, everybody. <laughs> well, we'll show Jerry later when we're at the Grove. So thank you guys so much for watching. Check out some of our other videos down below. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel if you're new and give this video a thumbs up, you guys. And we'll see you in our next video. Bye, everyone. Bye, guys. Bye.